Yeah, I've had several guys that maybe this is their first rollout wheel and they're, they're wondering about the motion. I like to rest my hip on my truck, uh, my forearm on the hand wheel right here, and here's the action right here. I take these two fingers and this fat part of my hand right there, just slowly roll like that, nice and easy. Or your thumb and two fingers. I'm not grabbing it, horsing it around, or you know, trying to do this number. I'm like this. If it's if it's out of uh, balance, then I throw a counterweight on it. It's an easy action like this, just nice and slow and steady. Rest in here, rest in here. I'm nice and relaxed on that fill pass. I'll lean my rod back, not like this, but I'm back back like this, and you can just stack that material in there and pretty much flush it out on a rollout with one pass. And you're looking for the edge. Um, just past the edge, just flush that thing out. You can stack, I even use 3 16 on two inch on a filler pass and then it works. Um, you'll get a little prettier cap with a five, but um, you can do 3 16 but you can certainly fill with that on almost everything uh, and really put some metal down in a hurry. Uh, and it, it helps to have a nice smooth roller on the other end, like this is the self-leveling roller from Off the Hook Design and Fab. I make these. How they work is they self-level and they, they level themselves to the pipe and they, they align themselves to the pipe so they don't walk like your traditional heads like this. These are handy sometimes if you've got a skinny spot, but yeah, if you ever use these, you know they're a walking son of a gun. They want to get sideways and crooked and start traveling down the pipe and the jack falls over. These don't do that. So you want to support your pipe out here. They're super smooth. They can hold more capacity than the jacks can. You can put thousands of pounds on these and they still roll smooth. This is another style that I make. They're all stainless balls. You can slide pipe back and forth this way on them as well as roll. So these make a great support also. And unlike some of the other ones that are on the market, these are super smooth. They're billet machines. They don't flex. They don't croak when you put a bunch of weight on them. Also, some of the problem is you, you collect, you know, some of this mill scale and dirt and dust on the pipe and it gets in the balls and then, then they're all clogged up and don't work it. These have multiple weep holes. Um, if you look at that, they're kind of self-cleaning. You can also just pull them out really easy, spray them out, like WD-40 or something. Just drop them back right in. You get a nice smooth roller, uh, super high capacity. You can put 1,100 pounds on these and they still roll smooth. That takes six inches and roll it with one hand. So they really roll smooth, um, easy to clean, stainless balls, so they're not rusting. You can also just pop these out and store them in the cab of your truck so they're not getting weathered. Um, so those are some things to help you roll. And again, the action right here is just nice and relaxed and just that's the motion you want right there. It's nice and smooth and steady. Something heavy, throw a counterweight on it. Balance it so it rolls smooth. You can check out my products at offthehookdesignandfab.com.